Hello, hope you're doing good. I'm your host Jason. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use Venture Planner AI. Venture Planner AI is a platform that will allow you, by simply filling out some boxes, by simply ticking some boxes, you'll be able to use their AI platform to create a business plan for you. And the beautiful thing about this is you can get started for completely free. Once on VenturePlanner.ai, you're going to tap on Try for Free in the top right hand corner. After you have tapped on Try for Free, you'll be redirected to this page. And all you have to do is simply scroll down. After you have scrolled down, you can see right here what stage is the business at currently. And you can select Idea, Startup or Growth. And this is basically how you're going to fill it out step by step in what country is your business located in and from here you can type in the country that you're located in or you want to start a business in then you can simply scroll down you can select the currency that you're going to use for your business what will your business do so let's say for example we will be reselling we will be reselling laptops so you can do that right there after doing that, you're going to scroll down and you can see right there, please choose the option that most accurately describes the business and you can tap on load AI suggestions. After you have done that, you're going to give it a few seconds and from there, you can see the different options pop up and you can tap on it. Then after you have done that, you're going to scroll down and you can see what will your business be called. You can either enter the name that you would like to use right there, or you could tap on suggest name. After you have tapped on suggest name, you're going to give it a few seconds while the AI comes up with some options that you can use. And you can see that it has come up with some catchy options that you can use right here. All you'll need to do is tap on the one that you'd like to use, then scroll down, and from here you can enter your name. After doing that, you can tap right here and select your role. Then from there, you're going to scroll down and you can choose to register with Google or you can create a username right there. So I'm going to tap on register with continue your setup as you can see right here. All you'll need to do is tap on continue business plan. After you have tapped on continue business plan, you can see initial plan set up. You'll scroll down a bit and you're going to tap on continue and you're going to continue filling out some simple questions, just some yes and no questions as you can see right here. Has the business been established or have people begun working within the business? You can select no or you can select yes. When are you planning to establish the business and you can select it right there. So let's say for example 2024 and we plan on starting in Q3. Then you can scroll down what type of plan would you like to create and you can select the options whether a full business plan or a basic business plan. You can select that right there. After doing that, you can scroll down how will the business be structured from a legal perspective and you can choose right there. And then after doing that, you can scroll down apart from you. Will there be any other individuals employed and you can tap on yes or no whichever one is suitable for your desired business. Will this change in the short to medium term? More than likely, yes. So I'm going to tap on yes. Then from there, in what town or city will the business be located? And you can simply type in the town or city right there. Then after doing that, you're going to scroll down, which of the below best describes the area that your business will be operated in. And you can select the option right there. After doing that, you're going to continue scrolling down. And just like that, you'll continue filling out most questions. Will the business distribute, sell or resell any product? And you're going to tap on yes. Then from there, how can these products be grouped? And you can select the options right there. So I'm going to select use laptop. Then from there, will the business manufacture any of these products? You're going to tap on no. Then you'll continue scrolling down. Will the business provide any services? 
specific products and services do you want to include details of any flagship products going to tap on no then you can see right here will the company own any in inventions digital assets discoveries trade 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 secrets no then will the business have any protected intellectual properties so i'll tap on no right there and you can continue filling it out once you're finished filling it out all you'll need to do now is tap on finish in the bottom right hand corner and then from there you'll be able to get your business plan you'll be able to view it and as i said earlier all of this is completely for free and as you can see right there all i simply did was tap on some yes or no questions and that's it do you plan to raise finance support no and that's basically it as you can see right here exit plans do you have any exit plans and i'll tap on no right there once you're finished you're going to tap on finish in the bottom right hand corner then you're going to give it a few seconds and you can see right here fill out the question you're provided for each section and you're going to tap on continue and you can continue filling it out just like what i was doing earlier hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe and thank you for watching